Hello everyone, Chris Reynolds again here at Gospa Missions and Abode for Children. And you know, today is All Hallows Eve. And it is not, Halloween is not a celebration. It does not worship the devil. That is not what it's about. Hallows means holy. So Halloween is a celebration of the Feast of All Hallows, All Saints. It is a day when Catholics celebrate the triumph of the Church in Heaven and the lives of the saints on Earth. So all of these ghosts and goblins and, and all of this, it's not what it was supposed to be about. Got co-opted like a lot of them. But we've taken over a lot of pagan holidays to make them Catholic Christian. So as we go out, I know the kids will go out tonight. My daughter's going trick-or-treating. And we pray that they will be safe. We pray that they'll get good candy that's not tainted. And it's sad that we need to go through and check and make sure that, that the candy. I remember as a kid going out and we would get bags of cookies. That homemade cookies. They're so much better than the candy. Today you can't can't do that. You can't make cookies and give them out in bags. You have to buy pre-sealed candy. Why? Because there's some evil people out there that taint the goodies for the children. And that's just sad. It's sad that we live in a world that doesn't respect life. It doesn't respect children. It doesn't appreciate the children. Now, having teenagers, there's some days where that's a little tough to begin with anyway. But, you know, we try to raise our children to be good and holy people. To go out and make a difference in the world for our Lord. That's what we try to do. Does it work all the time? No. The world is very, very tough on us. I couldn't imagine being a child today. Or even a teen today. So much different than when I was a teenager. With all the social media and the devices and screens and You know, there's a, a friend of ours, their daughter, and a friend of hers started a, I think it's a podcast called uh, Media Moms. Check it out. Check it out. It's talking about screen time for kids. And it's something we need to look at. I, I, I've made mistakes in that realm over the years. Screen time for kids. If I could go back and change it, how would I? can't change the past. All we can do is try to change the future. Trying to change the future is hard because you got to change the present. But today, All Hallows Eve, let's think about the church. The church in heaven. The triumph of the church in heaven. And the lives of the saints on earth. How many saints, walking saints, do you know? I don't know if there's a whole lot of them. But there are quite a few people that have been in my life that I think, and, you know, Tom Murkowski's one of them. He went out and did God's work each and every day. And I hope and pray that he's in heaven and he's listed among the saints. Because that's all he really wanted to do. He wanted to become a saint. You know, I think of my mom and my dad that raised me, and, you know, she prayed a rosary a day for me. 17 years. Let's think about those folks as we prepare to celebrate a holy day of obligation for us Catholics, All Saints Day. And then on Thursday will be All Souls Day. We pray for all of those souls that have gone before us that are in purgatory. They're being purged of any, yes, their sins have been forgiven. They will be in heaven, but they need to be purified because we have to be as pure 
has gone, white as, white as snow. God bless you all. Be careful, be safe, and don't forget one thing, and let your kids know this, that Jesus loves you. God bless you all.